Bugaysera International Airport is located about 40 kilometers south of Kigali City is expected to be completed in the next three years at an estimated cost of $2 billion. The new facility, according to developers, will boast a 130,000 square meter main terminal building capable of accommodating 8 million passengers a year. The figure is expected to rise to over 14 million passengers in the following decades Ma. King it one of the busiest aviation hubs in Africa. Adjacent will be a dedicated cargo terminal capable of accommodating 150,000 tons of cargo a year. Qatar Airways will have a 60% ownership of the new airport as well as acquire 49% of shares in the national carrier Rwandair, offering access to over 65 locations around the world. The developers of this $2 billion airport want it to be the jewel in the crown of Africa's aviation industry. It is a partnership that intended to help Rwanda, landlocked in the center of Africa, achieve its aim of becoming the continent's centerpiece for air travel. The main objective of this effort is basically to make sure that Rwanda becomes an African hub where everyone will be transiting either for tourism, but also for business and different industries. The airport is being constructed in Rilama sector of Bugesera district, eastern province. It has large gates for dignitaries and ordinary passengers. Bugesera International Airport also has large passenger, staff checkpoints and cargo terminal, with a cargo area of 27,000 square meters. At least 150,000 tons are expected to be transited through the airport per year. The facility also has a separate boarding gate for staff and a presidential terminal building which can accommodate 200 people, a space for vehicles of security personnel. Communication towers has been also reserved regarding the parking lot. It is planned that parking for 249 vehicles will be built for staff in the first phase. The management will also have a parking lot for 250 for excluding the space for 12 large buses. As for regular passengers, there is a parking lot for 547 cars, 249 taxi cabs and 9 large buses in the first phase. A five-story building with the capacity to accommodate 820 people will also be erected for the airport's administration. It will also have for 1,500 meter runway. Construction works on the proposed international airport in Bugesera district have gained momentum and are expected to reach 70% by the end of 2023. There is optimism that it could be completed by 2026. This $2 billion Rwandan airport that could help African aviation take off. It will help address the prevailing challenge of a fragmented network of routes that means passengers often have to travel via Europe or the Middle East when flying between African countries. 